And we're back. Time for more missions. Can I take care of... Oh, wait, no. I didn't take care of everything. Urgh. I just remembered I forgot to fix the Vindicator. Although I could field it as is. But... Just in case... Sure, we'll wait a day. Actually, what's... How many contracts we got left? Whoops. You know what? We'll just go without the Vindicator for a mission. I think. Meh. Whoop. I mean, I mean to do that, actually. Oh, well. <laughs> Where's that at? That left front? Oh. Civilian extraction? Yeah. Mm. It's an escort. I'll just keep that as is. Okay, Kaiser gets to go... Uh, Toaster really needs XP, but... Mm. Sai so get in for toll. Uh, yeah. That'll be okay. Like, Toaster needs XP. I always want to make sure the leader is always getting XP. And Kane is in a very valuable role right now. He's like he gets the most XP because he's he's the brawler, he's the scout. He's also the most likely to die. So he needs as many levels as possible. There's gonna come a point where he's taking fire for everybody else so that the rest of us can shoot missiles and lasers and stuff like that. And he's getting AC twenties to the face. Man to the face, I'd kill him. But I mean, he could survive like chest shots. His he'll he'll keep his leg intact after an AC twenty. It'll be stripped pretty. It'll be like, all the armor's gone and part of the structure's gone. But I mean, the leg will still be there working. I think all of his limbs can survive an AC twenty. Maybe even the arms. I think everything except the head. Because he's got maxed out armor. I wonder. I'll look that here in a sec. Great. I get to choose between hellfire or a frozen death. Okay, as is, uh, his arms could not survive an AC-20. However, if he's in any sort of cover, he's fine. They would survive an AC-20. Ooh, hello. Already. Gonna be a good day, Tater. Heading out. Wow, really? You're gonna do that? What's up, boss? Okay. We can do that. I am more than happy to oblige. Let's see how you like this. Yeah, he's a super cover. Wasn't taking much damage from that. Kind of the problem with machine guns, they're, they're really, really affected by cover. Ready for orders. Uh, what if I jump? Ah. No problem, boss. That's why I jump. Hmm, we're not getting through that armor. Kane's not reaching it either. Yeah, whatever. 
The other two are long range, they can hit it if they want to. Well, I guess there goes his machine guns. If he even had machine guns. What what model locust are you? Not that it really matters. Okay, you're the SRM2 model. The Vindicator has bigger fish to fry. That big old tank over there. Mm -mm. Stupid strikers. Yeah, this could finish it. Locking on and firing it all. Add a girl. Best wife. Oi. I'm gonna beat your monkey ass after this. Standing by. Hmm. What do you suppose that is over there? I wish I could DFA of unknown target. I copy. Come on, Kane, go get him. Firestarter, eh? Giving him everything I've got. So this is where the radiation fiesta would have done better. Hi. Oof. You what, mate? Ready to get it on. Damn. Mm. Go be his ass. No! Oh, no! Bleh. Going. Ow, really? Okay. Fine, fight me. Right here. Mm -hmm. I can't see what that is. Now we can. I don't want that thing running around. Here Your turn, buddy boy. There we go. Enemy unit destroyed. Jumping again, huh? I'm being flanked. Oof. Hey, you're fine. They've blown past my armor. Good to go. Uh, you know what? Um, actually. Ready for orders. Not quite close enough. All right, fine. Can we see the line? If we go up here, though, it should be okay. We we'll go here. Affirmative. <coughs> Stand 
sensor lock. Waiting for orders. Uh, Sai, your heat's a little high. Actually, it's probably for precisely that reason that I should just. Fight them. Hmm. That's pretty okay. Squash that bug. Here we go. Really? We're gonna squash the bug. Engaging physical attack. You guys aren't hitting the juiciest bits. Locust has turned into an impenetrable wall. Well, this is just embarrassing. Yeah, that's fine. Copy that. You have the most close range f firepower. Firing all weapons. One of his lasers is hurt anyway, I guess. Mm, not close enough. Oops. You've got no heat, you can jump. Whoop. Wait a minute. You've got no heat, you can jump. Engaging jump jets. Wow, wait. We missed the fucking PPC. Grr. Go away. Morning. Detecting mech oh, god danger. damn it. Mm. Yeah. Oh, you are the worst. Uh, ah! F you. Took him down. Dick. Waiting for the shot. Uh oh. Warning. Heat exceeding recommended level. No shit. <laughs> Well, go hit him. Engaging physical attack. Ass wipe. Receiving you. I'm listening. A 
Location confirmed. Ooh, he unsteady. This Firestar is a troublemaker. Oh, now I'm just tearing you up. Aye, aye. Is that really good? Okay, it says it's good enough. Like, one of these missiles will knock him over. Bullshit! Mmm, you said you could... Ooh. I didn't pay attention to the line. Ugh! This is such horse shit. Commander. Why didn't I just have you scout? Uh, this is going so wrong. Ugh. Oh, this fucking thing. This fucking thing. Engaging physical attack. Uh. No damage. What is with this fire starter? Order. Oh my god, fucking die, you asshole. I'm guessing you didn't like that. You are resilient. Commander. Oi. No? There. Die! God, fuck you. Enemy down. You are not worth the damn effort. Ready for orders. Affirmative. I can Kaiser has head trauma right now. So this is a person running every point. Blah blah blah. Okay, that'd be dudes up there, I'm sure. <laughs> I didn't scroll over there. Why is that spot revealed? And we gotta jump system soon anyway, so I guess the, the injury isn't the worst thing ever, but ugh, still. Mm -hmm, I'm going. Coordinates received. On it. Prepare to meet the enemy. I guess I could turn on fast movement, but eh. I'd really only want it for like segments like this when I have to wait on the APCs to move. I love the missions where you do the base defense and it's like, oh hey, look, these engineers are gonna run out and fix the turrets and shit. And you get a bunch of turrets on your side when they're, they're already in your base. And then the APCs start fighting back to you. That's pretty fun. Oh yeah, so I'm putting together a, a, Warham, a Warhammer army, actually. It's not much. Well, two of them, actually. Uh, people that may have heard me talk about this before, 
may remember that I bought the first strike set, which isn't much, but I mean, yeah, it's a little, little baby start. I recently put the money into getting Dark Imperium. It should be coming today, which comes with a shit ton of models. Uh, the full core rule book, even though you only need like 15 pages of it. But it's, it's still a nice book, so, yeah. And I plan on getting No No Fear, which is another starter set. And it's like, why are you getting so many starter sets? Because the starter sets actually have the best, like, uh, price per model ratio or whatever. Plus, you get other cool stuff with them, too, like dice and rulers. And two of them have little paper sheet terrain, which is, you know, <laughs> nothing special, but I mean, it's there. And some other fun things that come with them. Um, like, hell, the bloat drone that comes with uh, No No Fear alone is worth, like, f like over 40 bucks. And this whole set is 68 And yet the set comes with, uh, like, 31 models? So, yeah, that's pretty cool. Can we, well, first I'm going to do my best to, you know, put the things together. And then I gotta look up, up like, how to do proper painting, because I, I love being creative. I really do. The problem is, I'm not the best artist. Now, this is basically just a color by number, kinda, or paint by number. You just look at how it's supposed to look like, okay, I'll just paint it like that. But, I mean... I don't know. I just figured mine are going to look like crap. So what I'll, the plan is to uh, practice painting on the pox walkers first. Because if those get screwed up, that's okay. Because guess what? They're horrible zombie monsters. Like, they're supposed to look fucked up. <laughs> it's just that one might look like he got a bit too much of Grandpa Nurgle's uh, attention. Whether that's a good thing or not, that's for you to decide. Plus, we got like a. It's not an official Games Workshop store, but I mean, it's a it's a it's a store that's recognized by the Games Workshop store finder aware. So I guess they have some sort of at least limited partnership or whatever. That's like like two miles from my house. Very very quick drive over there, so I'll be able to check that out. Pick up paints if I need them. Although most the stuff I've been getting so far, I've been ordering off Amazon. But later. When I need more paints and stuff like that, I can just run down there. See if, see if they have good prices on models or... Hell, maybe somebody's willing to sell. Right now I'm putting together... Uh, all three of the sets come with uh, Primaris Space Marines and uh, Death Guard uh, Chaos Space Marines. Now, I wasn't too interested in Chaos at first. I, I see the appeal because it's got, it's got Space Marines, it's got vehicles, it's got crazy cultists, it's got got uh, demons and monsters and that's where the death guard kind of appealed to me like oh it has like like oh look at these marines they look so fucked up right so let's just uh, there's the, 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 the horrible monsters in power armor plus the, the, the pox walkers they look cool and all this other stuff is just like disease death blah that's that's like neat stuff it's all gross and plus, anybody that's watched me play Hell Divers knows that I'm a big fan of chemical weapons. Who cares if it's if it means I'm spraying my own teammates with it? It's fine. So the Death Guard uh, appeal to me as far as chaos goes is something I can stick my teeth into. And here comes contact. As far as uh, the Marine uh, Space Marines go, I mean they they're like, hey, look, Ultra Marines, eh, eh? But I'm like. But everybody says, like, no, you don't have to pay them as Space Marines. Just pay them as whatever you want. Although it's probably best to do it as, like, something that's non, non, well, I mean, they have transfer sheets for Blood Angels, Dark Angels, and Space Wolves. But considering Ultra Marines are supposed to be just part of, like, general codex for Space, space Marines, you should probably stick with one of the, those sorts of chapters. Because, but, let's uh, see. Blood Angels, Dark Angels, Space Wolves, and Dark Templ or uh, Black Templars get their own special books because they're considered like special chapters or whatever. Get their own books, so... But I mean, all that doesn't matter because I'm going to be paying my salamanders because they're cool. 
<laughs> for, for really good reasoning, Steve. <laughs> uh, you know what? There we move. Because like in, in a shitty place like the Imperium, well, like well, not just the Imperium, just the entire galaxy. There, it's like how can I side with the Imperium of Man? They're kind of fascist dickheads. I know it's for survival and stuff, but man, I couldn't. I can't do that. It's horrible. So I was like, well, maybe I'll just go with the towel. They're they're cool. I don't mind my brain getting scrambled with too much, I guess. Considering how everything is so shitty, you know, it, it's kind of worth the trade-off. Their people live pretty well. Even their client races, I guess. Are they good? No. I, I mean, at least not the ethereal. Probably not the ethereal. It depends on your, your uh, outlook on them. Not the point, though. The point is, I was leaning towards Tau, but then I was like, I was looking at the different Space Marine chapters, like, oh, well, wait, here's something that's a little more my speed. The Salamators look, sound pretty cool. They're like one of the few chapters that are like, yeah, we should probably, like, prioritize, like, saving civilians, because isn't the whole thing about, you know, defending the Imperium, like, defending its res or citizens as well? I mean, it doesn't matter if they're not, like, particularly useful. There, there are charge, and yeah, which is kind of funny because the guys that are in the Salamanders look like the most evil people. They're, they're like super like 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 blacker than black skin. That came out wrong. I was like, are you saying black people look evil? No, no. I mean, because they also go. They also have like 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 glowing red coal eyes and stuff like that. They look like. Like demon people, but they're also like the nicest people ever, I guess. Because when they become space marines, uh, they still hang out with their families and shit, so that's cool. They maintain ties with their community. I think it's super cool, and that's that's a sign of the most important thing about humanity. I think is retaining your humanity. So that's I think that's why they appeal to me. I'm listening. No, it's not to say that all, you know, space being chapters are dickheads. Some are, I would say, are flat out fucking evil, even though they still serve the Emperor. But, um, some are definitely nicer than others. Like, the Space Wolves are cool. Like, when some shit went down Armageddon, it's like, oh, well... We can't let the the guardsmen here know that chaos exists. We gotta like, you know, kill all the, all them and the civilians off. And the space wolves are like, whoa, that's fucked up. At least when it came to the guardsmen, I don't know if I cared about the civilians, but they at least gave a shit about the guardsmen. And so now, the the space wolves are 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 not very good friends with the uh, Inquisition. They're like bitter rivals and stuff. They're good for the space wolves. They're cool. And plus, they're space Vikings. How can you not like that? Or depending on who you're li listening to, they're also just a bunch of furries. <laughs> Which, whatever. <laughs> I think it's kind of funny. Waiting for orders. Okay, what are you... Can you... Get, yes, you can. Um, yeah, you know what? Go ahead and take out that, that little... I mean, it's kind of a waste. You know what? Go ahead. Affirmative. You're turning your back, but you should be okay. So that way, next time, turn you can fight the panther. I piss on your grave. Vehicle trash. Really? Wow. All right. Sure. Hit him with the PPC. Kaboom. Oh, 
Bluey. Enemy unit destroyed. The striker's more dangerous than the spider. <laughs> Let's be real. Waiting for orders. Roger that. You know, there's a half decent chance I could kill a spider right now with what he's got. Oh, it's getting more fucked up than I thought. Roger. Yep, there he goes. Ooh, face down, ass up, the EDF way. Right here. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yes, I am. Oh, geothermal. I don't want to go geothermal. Whatever. Well, nothing internal, but no oh well. Make Kane's job a little easier. The hell was that? <laughs> Commander. Oh, hello. Um, take from that side. Aye, aye. Locked on for physical attack. Oof. Hey, Toll, how you going? How's it going, man? I've got you out for this battle, but you'll be in for the next one. Don't worry. We were so close to getting the Shadowhawk earlier. Still on the lookout for, um, Hunchbacks. I haven't seen any yet. Jumping. Yeah, he's fine. Here it By the way, I'll make it, I want to make it clear to anybody watching. We we don't have to fight all these, but I want more salvage. Moving. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's fine. We're heat neutral with it, basically. Come on. Dah. Oh, there goes his left side. <laughs> so that's what's his... Is that where his arms are? Or is it in the left torso or is that center torso? Well, it doesn't matter. I, b I believe the missiles are in the left torso anyway. Really? He didn't fire? Okay. Yes, Commander. Hmm. Your legs are fine. You know what that means. Now, your chance to hit is shit, but... Let's try it anyway. Death from above! Acknowledged. Goo! Oof! There goes his right side. Blech. Mech destroyed. Bitch. Mission successful. Well, except for that fire star in the beginning, I had to deal with everything went pretty smooth. He did not go well at all. Survived everything. Hit me in the freaking head. Uh, yeah, okay, time for a good chunk of cash. Mm. Okay, what do we got? Now, I could complete a spider, but... I mean... Uh, anything special? No, we haven't seen anything special yet. I did enable that, right? I, I could finish a locust or a spider. I'd rather have the more valuable panther. 
Yeah, it's a machine. I need flamers. Wait, somebody needs somebody needs to cough up flamers. Come on. I need my little rabid wolverine that's gonna latch onto a salt mix. <laughs> and then hopefully not get decimated by an AC twenty. Probably would happen though. Set cane loose on a Atlas. I'm sure it'll go well. At least I know it wouldn't fire the LRMs. At least it probably wouldn't. Not at point blank. Let's see, I think it has what? Four medium lasers, AC 20, LRM 20? Or 15? I think it's 20. SRM 6. I think that's it. Does it have a small laser? I don't think so. Uh, any other contracts? Do we want to... I mean, I guess we could go ahead and do a pirate one, sure. Sure, why not? Let's just do it and then get on our merry way. Uh, not really worth it. Let's just try for salvage. Okay, well, you're out. Uh, guess what, Toll? You're taking point. Uh, Panther L. Nah, eh, we'll put you in Disco Jenny. Oh, wait, the Panther B's effed up. Uh. Well, use the other Jenner. There we go. Yeah, we're good. Disco Jane should perform fairly well in the Tundra. A little light on the armor, though. Really light. <laughs> no worse than a normal Jenner, but... I don't even know why I bother taking so much salvage. I doubt we're even going to get 14 pieces. Hell, I might be surprised if we get 10, considering it's a half skull. Maybe call it quits after this one? It's getting close to two. It's not too far off in two hours. We'll float over to our next destination then and probably call it quits. Hopefully get some tougher missions next time. Strike the convoy. Reckon this will help with the heat dispersal. Somewhere yes. Anyway. Yes, ma'am. Got it. Affirmative. Roger that. Position confirmed. I've got eyes on the target. So Kane could just stomp the convoy as it passes by. <laughs> All the mechs here are pretty fast, except for the Panther. Kind of slow, but that's alright. She's got the large lasers, so she can engage from a good bit away. Yeah. Heading out. Mm -hmm. Moving to position. Oh, hello. We'll get there. On the move. I copy. What do we got over here? It's just a galleon. Um, 
Let's just keep reserving. They're supposed to get over here, right? Reserve again. Sure, no problem. Standing by. Sensors have something. Mm-hmm. There should be anything else, but I'll reserve one more time. No, there was something else. Probably one of the actual APC. Probably the actual APC. Yeah, it's got to be the APCs. Standing by. All right, Kane, get the jumping. Lots of targets. Sensors locked on. Ready for orders. Uh, you can't quite. No, oh, you can get over here. Okay, let's let's move you first. Cause I'm not even sure if you can do anything. Yeah, you can. Affirmative. Everything. Goodbye. Oops, I made a mess. Well, gee golly, I made a mess. Hello, what do we got here? No problem, boss. I got this. Mobile HQ, huh? This is firing at that mech up there. It's got way too much invasion. Receiving you. Uh, jump. That'll do. All right, Disco Jenny, let him have it. Target destroyed. There goes the mobile HQ. A scratch. Commander. Um. You know what? You'll be fine. Get in there. I don't want to strip your evasion. I kind of want to strip your evasion. Yeah. Yeah, it was okay. Receiving you. Hmm. You know what? Acknowledge. You're too evasive. Engaging. Oh, he didn't like it. Target's taking a critical hit. And your heat was high anyway. Standing by. Speaking of high heat. Go get him. The spider does not like it. Uh, that's pretty good. That's way too much armor to get through. What the hell were you aiming at? No, really, what in the hell were you aiming at? Were well, the percentages not high? I wasn't paying attention. It was good on everything else. Hmm. 
Well, Toaster, that was embarrassing. Quite embarrassing. Wow. Speaking of embarrassing, this one's got a hit, right? This one's got a hit. So <laughs> use the laser. You guys are going to get so horribly stomped here in a sec. What the hell was that? <laughs> that bird won't fuck with you anymore. Stupid. That's gotta be Kane. Um. Ready for orders. Kill this thing. All your turn. There we go. Hostile removed. Yes, Commander. Let him have it. F you. Dick lasers engage. One for the scrappy. I think they're kind of more of a stomach or chest. Shut up. Yeah. Roger that. Okay, which one's the galleon? Oi. There we go. Locking on and firing it on. There we go. Much better. Target destroyed. Oh, these fools are getting trashed. And yeah, not worth it to take the salvage, it looks like. I should just field a bunch of fire stars at some point. That'd be fun. Ow. We have three now. That's pretty good. Heading out. Go get him. Targeting for physical attack. That's last of the escorts. He's dead, Kane. All right. Enemy vehicle. Destroyed. You're racing valuable ammunition. Ready for orders. Yeah, we can break through. Confirmed. Double damage, yeah. Locked on for physical attack. Sweet. Reporting. One less vehicle. So all we really did is just do a bunch of stomping. I'm okay with that. Targeting for physical attack. Leopard inbound, Commander. I meet you at the LZ. Mission. Boy, we stopped the shit out of everything. It was great. Almost everything was killed with melee. Let's see. Toaster killed a, t a tank with lasers. Yeah, I think everything, I think everything else is melee. So we wouldn't have gotten too much anyway. Well, this is a good amount of loot. So this probably was the be better choice, I guess. Uh, let's see. We'll take a spider. A spooter. And we'll take the LRM racks. Those are always going to be 
helpful. They get blown up and stuff. And we got an AC5. Hooray. Let's kind of hope we get at least one. Oh, excuse me. Did I already check this store? I guess I'll find out here in a sec. Da, 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 da. And then call it quits. See if we move on to the next system. I think. Cameron. Cameron, you can do it. Yeah, yeah, Spooter. <laughs> like, can we make the Spooter into anything useful? Okay, first of all, let's check our Mech Warriors. Let's see if they learned anything fun. Uh, ah, Kane is just short. Master Tactician. Uh, you are doing more guts next? Overheat threshold. Yeah, you don't really need piloting that much. Oh, wait. I was going to do, uh, yeah, the rest of tactics. Yeah, let's do that first. Okay, so wait. Nothing Ready for orders. Nothing for Kane quite yet. Sai, what do you got? Are you get you cool and vent? Hmm. Hmm, mm-hmm. Uh, so she's not ready. Ready for orders. You, you're working your way towards breaching shot, so you're not ready yet either. <clears throat> okay, so the video is pretty much over. But if you want to stick around for a little bit of faffing about with the mechs, cool. Uh, okay, let's let's get you repaired. Jeez, ten thousand bucks. Repair. Now, what can we do with a spooter? Absolutely nothing. It's got two laser slots. That's it. Like nothing else. Wait, does it have? Su it does have support slots. But it's melee is crap, doesn't it? Uh, okay, it doesn't have any bonuses anyway. I mean, I guess you could run in and do like 30 damage. Uh, I guess. Like, you can't even stick a PPC on this thing unless you strip armor off. And then that's all you get is the PPC. Although that would be kind of funny. Um. <coughs> God, this thing would... Wouldn't survive like anything. There, but you fit a PPC on there. <laughs> I mean, if you really, really want to scout, I guess you could put like a large laser on it. It can't even put on like any missile racks or anything. So what are you supposed to do? You just put on medium lasers. <laughs> what if? What if we did that? I mean, it can't fit much, but. Can't hold a lot of jump jets. Max up the armor. I mean, no, it's still a piece of shit. But that's probably where it's at its most useful. What if I take away two jump jets? That's better. 
How many jump jets do I need to take away to max this thing out? Uh, that's pretty close. So, I mean, if you wanted something really fast to go into melee, I guess that's a thing. If you really like the spider, this is probably what you should do. Maybe do a little scrappy melee fire, although I can't take shit for damage. Spider's crap. Go away, Spooter. We're finished with you. You're garbage. Um, so what all do we have in storage now? We have a f fire star. We have a Jenner. Two Panthers. Four Spiders. Two Commandos. Two Locusts. So we're sitting on a good bit of cash. That's our... <laughs> This mech bay is our rainy day fund. We sell mechs only when we need them. I need to sell them. It's not like I'm ever going to pull like spiders out and use them, right? So it's like, why don't I just sell them all now? Well, because then I'm like, oh, I've got all this money. I'm just going to go ahead and blow it on hookers and blow or whatever. I'd rather save it for a time where I'm like, hmm, oh shit. Uh, I'm kind of low on C bills for the month. I need to pay people. Let's go ahead and just you know, sell a mech or two. Or if I really want to go ahead and buy the next engineering upgrade. Or... Hey, you know what? I feel like it's, it's a good month to do uh, extra morale. Let's sell a mech and, and get a better morale for the month. Something like that. Uh, let's see... Uh, I don't need anything there. So, where to next? Here we got a pair away there again, it looks like. Actually, you know, we might as well stop by, stop by Bella Ferron. They're going to pay for our shit. And there's clearly two, uh, there's like two missions waiting there for us. So let's do four observancy. That's a battle, and that's recovery. Okay. Well, you can get a lot of salvage in that one. Um, this is fine. Calculating course now, Commander. That mission will cover just about all the month's expenses anyway. Wasn't that nice? Things to update you on, boss. What's next? Yeah, improved automation. Why not? Plus three tech points. All right, I'll Let's max this shit out. Away. Fix our mix up quicker. Crew's ready for the next job. Hooray. You know... Wait a minute. Isn't there a thing to improve the engines? Oh yeah, that's it. We need... Improved power conduit. Okay, so we should work on that next. So we spend less time traveling. We need improve. Okay, yeah, we improved... And then we'll do the improved ship drive. And yeah. Moonlighting with an auto cannon. While pacing through the mech bay on a sleepless night, you stumble across Toll. He is fiddling with a stock auto cannon. A jumble pile of loose metal and wire litters the deck around him. As you approach, Toll looks up, a sheepish grin on his face. Uh, hello, Commander. I was just trying to tune this beauty, maybe get a little more performance out of her. Can you do me a favor and keep this from the chief, though? though he's already shooting me out of here once this week. You know, I mean, it's probably random each time, but we tried this before and said, it's not a mech warrior's job, or did I do this on my other file? Whatever. 
and he's gotten low spirits. Let's let's just see what he does with it. I'm gonna keep working on it. I suppose that was in storage for a reason, so we can afford to lose it if things go wrong. Just be careful. These weapons are meant to destroy mechs, after all. Later that week, Toll catches you in the hall with an update. Commander, I'm sorry to report I wasn't able to modify the weapon like I wanted to. But I was able to put it back together again just the way it was before. Double and triple checked it, to be sure. So I'm guessing that's a thing where it's probably either... There's probably a chance of destroying the, one of your weapons, uh, a chance of hurting himself, or a chance of, hey, this AC-5 became an AC-5+, plus or something like that. I'm going to guess. Well, totally easy to blow yourself up. I guess that's all I can ask for. At least nothing bad happened. I'd rather nothing spectacular happen than you get blown up. How about that? I can't remember who I told not to do it before. But they were just butthurt the entire... Like, like for a month. Because I was telling them, No, don't do that. You don't know what you're doing. Okay, you're a little bit behind, so you need more playtime, clearly. Don't want to buy better morale yet. Not yet. We're almost completely out of cash. Oh, we're fine. Do you know how many like spiders I'm sitting on? It didn't sound right. Uh, not yet. Let's make sure Kaiser's back and ready to go. Okay, and we'll call it quits here. Thank you, YouTube, for watching, and we'll catch you guys next time.